Good morning, good afternoon, good day. I'm excited. Woke up. Credit score went up 24 points. I'm with it. Coming to put my shelf up. Let's get it. Merry Christmas! So the Wayfair Handyman service is one of the best things you can get. They're coming to put my shelf up here. I talked about that. That was kind of depressing because not only is shipping delayed, but they kind of forgot to send these out. This thing was ordered since the 1st of December, but none the little yeah. decor, like the gold and the marble there. Remember, I on a previous, previous vlog, I got these from Hobby Lobby. Um, but it doesn't really go with the silver and the bling that's in here now because remember... In the moving process, my bedroom will now hold more of the silver, the bling, the rose gold. Out here, it's still going to be jewel tone and golds. And y'all, $48 for this tall table, $42 for the small one. I kind of like the staggered look. And I'm cool with that. I'm not going to do a coffee table because I want to go with the less is more. But yeah, I'm loving these. And then this right here, bath and body, this marble base gold geometric candle holder will just tie everything in um black friday when you could have stacked coupons versus 29 dollars for one i got two i have the second one here um haven't used them but you know that's what it is but today and today my friends we gonna record some peppermint mocha cupcakes from the box another box cake hack I don't know why they always go viral, but the semi-homemade is, is, is cool with me. So, I'm going to let Wayfair in, let them do their thing, and let's get to be. Forgive me, y'all, if my sound is off, but we're going to go ahead and get started. These are all the ingredients. Remember, anything except water is best for your box cake mix. So that's the chocolate devil food cake mix in the bowl with a box of chocolate pudding and one packet of mint hot cocoa mix, okay? So all you want to do is get all your dry ingredients combined nice and well. And then we're going to go back with, um, I think what's next is going to be three eggs. I did three or four, three eggs. I did three. Yeah. Okay. So I'm talking faster than the voiceover, but then some parts of this is sped up. So I don't want to lose myself. Um, we're going to do butter, but you're going to do two fourths cup butter. So if you have a one third cup measurement on your measuring cup, just do the one third twice. Okay. And to heighten up your chocolate flavor, that's a cup of cold coffee. Um, out of that cup of cold coffee, I only use a third, okay? Um, coffee just heightens anything, chocolate. Remember on my box cake mix hack video, we talked about that flavor-wise? Yep, that works, okay? And a cup of half and half and a third cup of sour cream. And then we want to go back with a third cup of the peppermint mocha creamer, Okay. I dropped some peppermint, like, like three drops of peppermint extract down in the cake, as well as you're going to see me put that in the frosting, and just a little drop of vanilla, just a little. So back to that butter, the melted butter, remember, two-fourths cup, that's just a third cup twice, okay? So the Ghirardelli peppermint bark, I chopped it up, put it in the microwave 15 seconds at a time. It took me about two times to smooth, Okay. And then I ended up pouring that down into the cake. And that's the vanilla. That's the peppermint. We want to get everything whipped up. And then I believe that's the end. We want to load it into the cupcake liners. And these bake for 15 minutes at a head. Be sure to not over bake. Here's the peppermint that I mentioned that I dropped in the frosting. And this cheap $7 piping bag was the best thing ever. Now, the tips you actually keep, but I like the disposable bags. And I whipped it on there with some red and green sprinkles to look very, very festive. Okay. Get into the holiday season. These are my homemade videos really be taking off on TikTok. I don't know. My YouTube algorithm is not that great, but the TikTok one, you got your girl over here in the creative sun getting paid. And to garnish it, we want to take these white chocolate covered pretzels that's crushed with candy canes, and that's going to seal the deal. 
And I'm going to put these in a cupcake container. You can find at Michael's or Amazon, but the grocery store I frequent, I ask, and they just give them to me for free. And these are going in the fridge so we can head home to Charleston on Christmas Eve. And this is the finished product. Merry Christmas! Why you shake that jingle bell, that jingle bell? Come on, hey! So all in all, y'all, we end the night with 281 large candles. I took possession of my floor bag. Um, I don't want to show y'all the single wicks and the wallflowers, but just know that my candle collection.